Now today is day one of our Florida trip. So currently we just got to our condo and this is my room with like my bed over here and my brother's bed over there. Um, I have my bag down here that I brought. My fluffer and crocken bag with my Bible and journal. And I have a Germax right here that has a turtle and it's warm vanilla sugar. Inside here, I just have my Invisalign case and my AirPods, which I have my Invisalign in, so I don't have anything else. And then I have a couple bracelets, which I'm not wearing because I don't want like five bracelets in my hand. Um, I'm gonna keep these out because they're, we touched a lot of stuff out there, so I'm gonna put some Germex on. We, there was a lot of stairs, but we took the elevator because nobody really wants to take the stairs, you know. Inside my bag, I, I already said I had my journal and my Bible. Also, I have a charger because I brought both chargers because I've been seeing that one of my chargers has been messing up, so I left it in the car. So it's gonna be over here. I don't know what to do with this. Um. This is my bag full of pins and pencils and stuff. This is my umbrella, which is a smaller umbrella. I really like this color. So I'm gonna be taking this to Disney World tomorrow and all the other things. This is our games. We have face pin and cards to play. Uh, like Spy and Malice, uh, Battle and everything. Also what I brought with my Skittles, which are, it's a resealable bag. So if you wanna stop eating them, you know. This is my purse, obviously. I have my ID and my wallet, which I don't know what I'm gonna be able to buy because I have like $30, so we'll see. And I have my mask because you always need a mask now whenever you go out places. <laughs> and this is what I'm gonna be taking my Flutter and Conkins to Disney tomorrow. And I'll, I'm gonna leave my Skittles here because I don't really need to eat those. I'm gonna leave them in the kitchen. And then here's my journal, which I need to read the Bible, which I think I'm going to just read it right now, just when, without the door closed, because I need to think before I go to bed tonight, because if I go to bed, I'll be tired and I won't have time to read, you know? Here's this. Which I feel better taking my, my bag to Disney World, because I don't want anybody to take my purse, because purse, it's like around my neck, it's bothering me. And um, so I just feel better with this. And so I'm just going to be leaving this bag right here and also the cards, my skittles, which I did say I was going to leave my skittles in the kitchen, but right there is fine. And then my bag until my brother gets out of the bathroom, I'll just leave it. And this is what I brought in my little vanity bag. I'll tell, I'll tell you the password and it wanted to get Okay, there. just a second. I'm making a video. So, in my vanity bag, I bought my toothbrush and toothpaste, which I've been starting to use the Triple Action toothpaste from Colgate, which has cavity protection, wider teeth, and fresh breath. And I've only missed, I think, like, maybe five or eight days last month and this month. I brought my hair ties from Vera Brindley and a brush and a comb, um, a deodorant, some floss, and picks and some cuffs because I'm gonna try and floss my teeth every single night this week, which I don't know, that might be a little too much. This is my new body wash called a Bonfire Bash, my conditioner and shampoo. And then here's some necklaces that I brought. I'm gonna put one on now. I brought my daughter necklace that I got my mom, the mother necklace for Mother's Day. Why don't you give it to mom? I already gave her hers. Give you yourself yours? Now I'm going to close. Victoria, the password is, is vacation. Okay. This is my little Burst Bees lip, lip stuff, lip moisturizer balm. And this is my eyeglasses case because I'm pretty sure we're going to be going swimming sometime today or tomorrow or something. So I'm just going to be leaving all this stuff in until my brother gets out of the bathroom. I'll just leave it all in my baggie and leave my baggie in the bathroom. <laughs> so.
so yeah, um, I'll pack this up and show y'all in a second um, what I have in my drawer with all my clothes. So the next thing I'm gonna show y'all is my clothes. So what I brought was this shirt and these shorts, that skirt and that Disney shirt under there. And then the last one is, um, I don't know if I can get to it. This white shirt of purple. And then I brought some, I think it's green shorts, which yeah, some green shorts. They're right there. If you, sorry, if you can't see them. Next I have this shirt and these pants, which I brought some pants just cause I didn't have any more shorts left. Um, this pink shirt and these khaki pants shorts and then that shirt um, and those purple shorts. Three bras because I'm wearing one and then I'm wearing, I have but two. Seven panties, seven um, pairs of socks because I'm going to be wearing socks every day. Sorry about the fan, that's kind of annoying. And then one sh short sleeve t-shirt for nighttime. And then one like petite pants and then long pants because I'm probably sure I'm gonna wear the long pants and then wash them because I get pretty cold at night sometimes. And then one bathing suit, which I got a new bathing suit shirt this um, summer. And then that's all I brought for the right here. Next thing on my shoes that I brought were my new tennis shoes, which I showed in the yesterday day in a life. These and then these flip flops, which I've had for two summers. They're already getting kind of dirty, but they were in my bag, so we'll see. That's all I brought. What I have inside my closet, and since my turbo twisty is still slightly wet, so I hung it up in the closet. Um, that's all. I can show y'all the outside of the house. Um, yep, let's go. First of all, I'll show you the room, just an overview. This is the living room and the kitchen. Hey. Okay. And the patio. Oh, hey, y'all. Okay, that's the pool down there. And the TV. Yeah, that's kind of a tour. I didn't want to go too long into it because I don't know who really wants to be in it, you know. So next I'm going to be closing my door, read my Bible, because I have to do chapter 8 today. And then I'm going to go out there on the patio and just chill and watch the pool, because we actually have the pool like right behind our condo. It's like a big um, apartment kind of thing, and then there's another house that's kind of the same, I think, on the other side. So yeah, I'll get back to y'all right after I read the Bible and I'll tell y'all about what I learned. So right now I just finished reading chapter nine of, or chapter eight of Matthew. And in my Bible, it is the, my creative Bible, KJV, King James Version. And so my page is 1062. So in this one, I read about Jesus healing people, cleansing them and so he cleansed the leper, healed the cinch from the servant, uh, calms the sea, and cures two demonics. And in the next chapter, he cures a par paralytic. And I didn't want to stop reading it just because we're on vacation because I just thought that would help me even more to like do a Bible study while my vacation, which it's not going to take my mind off a of vacation because. I'm sure that God gave me this vacation just to like help me stop worrying about school and about driving and everything, you know, to keep my mind on something else. So, um, I just did a little prayer before I did this scene on YouTube video, um, because I like to do a prayer just so that way, um, God knows that I understand it and that he knows that I'm doing it for him. Even though sometimes I don't know like what to say in my prayer, I just try to say things like, watch over my family, let us all have a good day or a good week. Um, and I'm still keeping up on my log. Today was chapter eight. And I do them in different colors, but it's fun. If you do it in black pen or just one color, it can be as fun. So, yeah. I'm really excited for this trip. 
and um uh, yeah so tomorrow morning i'll either read the bible again read chapter nine or read um tomorrow night or afternoon i think afternoon or morning is a good time to read not at like 10 p.m or 12 a.m you know like really late or really early like pick a time like 8 9 a.m where you're like awake and you're thinking you know um so yeah um i put everything away and now i'm gonna go and walk outside on deck and show y'all more of the what's it called like outside of our patio i don't know what it is I'm trying to get my pencil back in there. and i'm definitely not taking my bible to disney world because first of all my mom said i can't and then second of all i don't want to lose it i'm trying to get my pen in there it won't come out So, I will see y'all next time when we do something. I don't know if we're doing anything later, but I'll do an update around like 4 or 5 p.m. Um, okay, so, for the last hour, I was just sitting in the living room with my parents talking about our trip to Disney tomorrow. Checking out the channels on the TV, which one of them, it's called uh, HGTV, doesn't work somehow. It's not turning on. So everything else is fine so we're getting the person to come and check it out um and i'm just chilling here i'm i have nickelodeon on but i'm not really watching it i'm on my phone about to charge it because it's at 25 percent so it's just getting very low i need to charge it we're trying to figure out dinner plans too we don't know if we're gonna go and out i really want to just stay in the house because we've just been in the car all day you know and tomorrow we're gonna be walking around a lot so yeah, I don't think we're doing anything else tonight. So I'm going to end the vlog here and just say that I'll tell you tomorrow if the TV works again. But it's just one channel, so I don't mind watching other things. Um, and yeah, I hope you all have a great day tomorrow. And, I mean, today and tomorrow. And come back for tomorrow's vlog if you want to see it. Again.